Chapter 11 Perimeter and the Area Part 4 Exercise 11.3 14th problem we will see Read the problem A circular flower garden has an area of about 340 meters square A sprinkler at the center of the garden can cover an area that has the radius of 12 meter The radius is 12 uh, meter Sprinkler is at the center of the garden, so radius 12 uh, meter, so that okay, it is uh, covering whole garden. Will the sprinkler water the entire garden take pi equal to 3.14? So radius is uh, given that is 12 meter uh, radius. Okay, that is you uh, name it r small r. Therefore, area covered by the sprinkler at the center of the garden equal to pi r square, area of circle that is, okay, correctly what circular garden, so it is circle, clear. Therefore, pi value is given, so you put it pi value, 3.14 into the r square is 12 into 12, r square 12 into 12, therefore 3.14 into 144, just to multiply this. 3, 14, 44, 144 multiplied. 16, 452.16. After decimal, two digit there. So leave two digit and keep the point. This much uh, meter square, meter square. But this is actually what the greater than this is greater. So, uh, this is actually greater than 3, 14, uh, what a meter square. Then, uh, it will cover the entire God. Here. So this is uh, greater than 314 meter square because the circular uh, flower garden has an area of about 31 meter square. Therefore, this is uh, what this actual area because the radius is 12 meter. Therefore, the area you are getting greater than of this. Here, greater than of this you are getting. Therefore, uh, definitely the sprinkler will water uh, in the entire garden. Okay, the entire garden. You see the next two problem, uh, sixth problem. How many times a wheel of radius 28 centimeter must rotate to go 352 meter? Take pi equal to 22 by 7. Pi equal to 22 by 7. Okay. So what you have to do is here uh, distance is given because to rotate to rotate to go what uh, 352 meter given that is a uh, what uh, distance sort is given distance covered distance covered equal to 352 meter okay what is radius radius is given 28 centimeter. So this one given centimeter. So better you change this one also centimeter into 100 centimeter. So this is total distance covered. Okay. Now how many times your uh, wheel? Wheel means uh, what? That is circular. Okay, circular. So one complete uh, rotation equal to circumference of the wheel. One complete rotation equal to circumference of the wheel. One complete. Complete revolution, revolution, complete or one complete rotation, rotation is equal to circumference of V, circumference of circle. That is a two pi r. That is two pi r. Okay. Understand? So that is equal to two into twenty two by seven into twenty eight. It will go. Four times, right? That is equal to forty-four into four. Forty-four into four. That is one seventy-six centimeter. One seventy-six centimeter. One complete uh, rotation is circumference of the wheel. Okay. So how many times a wheel uh, of radius means number of uh, rotations? Okay, number of rotations. Number of rotation, how many times it will rotate? Number of rotation 
equal to clear is equal to the total distance covered see this one centimeter this is also centimeter clear so the total distance covered by one rotation total distance covered by one rotation means you will get number of rotation number of rotations 352 into 100 by 176 okay I think a uh, four table uh, easily can uh, divide. This will go in four table means four times. This will also four times. This will also go four times means uh, 35, eight times. 35, eight times, right? Again, uh, three remainder, 32, again, eight times in four table. Now, this, uh, uh, this will go in uh, four table, 11 times. Okay, this will go. 4 table 25 times. Now this 11 will go 8 times. So 200 rotations. Clear? 25 to 8, 200 times it will rotate to cover this much uh, 352 meter. Okay. The wheel will rotate how many times? Uh, 200 times. Clear? To cover this much uh, distance. Understand? So this one purely application problem. Clear? You have to understand the problem, then apply the formula. Correctly, you will get the answer. Okay, so very important problem. This one, uh, purely application problem. This type of questions will be most of the time repeating. Okay, so next to topic, we will see applications, applications problems. Okay. So, first we will see the conversion of units. Conversion of units uh, already you might have studied in your class. Okay, you know very well 1 centimeter equal to 10 millimeter. Okay, that is in the scale you take the scale 1 centimeter. Clear? 10 line it will be there. Okay, you just what count 10 line that is millimeter. 10 millimeter is 1 centimeter. Each centimeter 10 10 line there. that is 10 millimeter. Okay. So, 1 centimeter will 10 millimeter. Then 1 centimeter square. Square it means what? 10 is square, 100. So, millimeter square. Both sides have to square it. Same way, 1 meter equal to 100 centimeter. 1 meter equal to 100 centimeter. Okay, that is 1 meter square. 1 is square is 1. 100 square is uh, 2, 0 there. So, 1 is followed by 4, 0. Okay. Now, 1 kilometer is 1000 meter. So, 1 kilometer square is 3, 0 there. 3 is followed by square means 6, 0. 1 is followed by what? Uh, uh, 6, 0 meter square. But uh, 1 hectare equal to what? 10,000 meter square. This is very important for 1 hectare because always uh, the land, okay, we will um, uh, we will use the unit as what? Hectare for the land and all. We will use the unit as what? Hectare. That's why 1 hectare equal to 10,000 meter square. You have to remember all this. Okay. It will be very useful for that. Now we will see the problems. A garden is uh, 90 meter long and is 75 meter broad. A path 5 meter wide is to be built outside and around it. Find the area of the path. Also find the area of the garden in hectare. The area of the garden easily we can find out. That is, the garden is uh, 90 meter long and 75 meter broad. Means length into length into width. Breadth, that is area of the garden. So now we have to find out the area of the path. How to find out the area of the path means around the 5 meter wide a path is uh, okay. First one inside you take that is uh, a garden rectangular garden. Okay, rectangular garden having a 90 meter and is 75 meter. Then wide 5 meter, wide 5 meter. Around means fully five meter around. This is also five meter. Five meter with five meter. Okay, this is path, this is path, right? This is path, the garden means like it is having the path around, clear? 
Understand? So the length is uh, what 90 meter, breadth is 75 meter, the width, the width is uh, what 5 meter, this is the width around 5 meter uniform width. Okay. okay, we have to find out the area of uh, what area of uh, path means uh, bigger rectangle area minus smaller rectangle area means you will get uh, what uh, area of path. You subtract means you will get area of path. Okay. So now what do you have to do here? Uh, this length you have to find out. This length is what? 100 meter because this side uh, 5 meter, this side 5 meter you add means from here to here 100 meter. Bigger rectangle length is 100 meter. This one, this side 5 add, this side 5, this side 5 add. 5 meter add, 5 meter to here 5 meter add means uh, 75 means 85. It will be 85, right? Okay. Gordon. Length of uh, Gordon is uh, 90 meter. Okay, and the breadth of Gordon that is almost 75 meter. Okay, therefore, the area of Gordon first to find out the area of Gordon in hectares. Area of Gordon means uh, these two multiply 90 into 75. That is equal to multiply means uh, 92 so 45, 4 remainder 63, 67. Okay, meter squared. In hectare, you have to change. Uh, if they ask in hectare, means uh, you have to divide it by. Okay, you have to divide it by uh, 10,000. Okay. 10,000 you have to divide. Hectare you have to write. Okay, so 1 cut, then 3 0 divide with 0 0.675. 0 0.675 hectare. This is the answer, right? Area of garden in hectare. Next, you have to find out the area of path. Area of path. Area of path is a bigger rectangle. Area of bigger rectangle minus area of smaller rectangle. Okay. Next, area of path equal to area of path equal to area of bigger rectangle. Minus area of Small rectangle. Okay, so area of bigger rectangle is what? Uh, Ten into hundred meter. This is hundred. Hundred meter. Hundred meter into eighty-five meter. Hundred into eighty-five. Minus area of small rectangle. Already we have done six seven five zero. Okay. Understand that is 90 into 75, that is 675. Or you write uh, better 90 into 75, you write then you can 90 into 75. L into breadth, that's all. Length into breadth. Okay, the so smaller one, bigger one. Okay, bigger one, length, how you are getting this side 5, this side 5, add from 90 means uh, uh, 90 plus uh, 10, 100. 75 plus uh, this side, this side 5, add means 75 plus 10, 85, right? Therefore, this is nothing but uh, 8500 minus this is nothing but uh, already we calculated that is 6750. Now you subtract. Uh, 5, 14 means 7, 1. So 1750 meter square. 50 meter square. But in hectare, we have to change means uh, divide us by 10,000. Hectare means divided by 10,000. You have to write the unit correctly. Okay. When you convert meter square to hectare, means divided by 10,000. Because you have uh, one, one hectare equal to 10,000 meter square. This unit you have to remember. Clear? Okay. One meter square means this 10,000 divided. 
that is this much meter square means this one you multiply means here you get okay to convert meter square to hectare to convert meter square to hectare divided by 10,000 okay now 1 zero you cut now here 3 zero that divide means 0 0.175 hectare understand so like this uh, easily we can do this application problem this simple type only we will ask understand so be the practice, be prepared, clear, thoroughly how to practice, okay. So this is also very important problem, okay, third problem. A picture is painted on a cardboard 8 cm long and 5 cm wide such that there is a margin of 1.5 cm long each of its side means of uh, a frame uh, of cardboard right? a picture a picture is painted on a cardboard 8 cm long that is length breadth 5 cm right then uh, you draw a margin of 1.5 cm all around all around the picture clear margin you have to draw like this means you will get the path you have to find out this area of path how much you have to find out okay find the total area of the margin is the area of the path you have to find out right that is equal to what the bigger rectangle area minus smaller rectangle bigger rectangle length and breadth given smaller rectangle in the picture itself you find out that is better okay you see this side 1.5 this side 1.5 means total 3 3 centimeter you subtract from 8 this total 3 this side 1.5 subtract okay this side 1.5 subtract means you will get this length that is 5 centimeter right 8 1.5 plus 1.5 what 3 okay so from 8 uh, subtract is 5 the diagram itself you find out it is easy clear now this side this side 1.5 subtract from 5 means uh, 5 here 1.5 here 1.5 3 centimeter you subtract from 5 means 2 centimeter Okay, two centimeter. Therefore, uh, you can try to find the total area of the margin. Okay, therefore, therefore, total area of the margin equal to straight away, right? Total area. You don't need to find out separately. Clear? Straight away, you can do total area of the margin is equal to area of path. Area of path. Area of path. Okay. What is area of path? Area of path equal to what? Area of bigger rectangle minus area of smaller rectangle. Area of path equal to area of bigger rectangle minus area of smaller rectangle. Bigger rectangle area minus smaller rectangle area. So what is a bigger rectangle area? Means bigger rectangle length and the breadth that is 8 into 5 minus smaller one 5 into 2. Okay, so this is 8 into 5 is 40. This is 10, so 30. So 30 centimeter squared. So area of uh, water margin. Area of margin is 30 centimeter square. Uh, next problem, fifth problem, very important. Okay. Square type. Fifth problem, very important. Listen uh, properly. A path 1 meter wide is built along the border and inside a square garden of side 30 meter. A garden. Uh, the form of a square, a square god and inside uh, one meter uh, what you have the path, you have the path, clear. Then find the area of this path, area of this path means as usual that is the area of uh, bigger square minus area of smaller square. Okay, so here bigger square side is given, smaller square side easily we can find out. This side one centimeter, this side one meter, total two meter you subtract means we get. 
that means 28 meter okay this side one this one this one one meter this side one meter this side one meter total two meter you subtract from the whole side means 28 meter it is okay <coughs> Therefore, uh, here you write that uh, side of bigger square, side of bigger or directly in the diagram also enough, okay, for understanding purpose I am writing, side of bigger square is 30 meter, therefore uh, side of smaller square, side of uh, smaller, smaller square is equal to 30 minus 2, 28 meter, okay, 28 meter. Therefore, area of path, this is the path area, you have to find out. What is the area of uh, square, side into side, okay, or uh, side is square, here side is square. Therefore, area of path equal to, area of, bigger square minus area of smaller square okay that is equal to area of bigger square means uh, side into side that is 30 into small 30 meter 30 into 30 meter that is 30 into 30 minus Area of smaller square side into side, side is uh, 20 meters, so 28 into 28. So 30 into 30, 900. 28 into 28, 784, right? 784 subtract 900 means 784 subtract, half of uh, 6, 1, here uh, 1, 116. 116 meter square, 116 meter square, 116 meter square, that is area of path. Now next to what they ask, the cost of planting grass, the remaining portion of the garden at the rate of 40 uh, per meter square. Twenty-eight into twenty-eight. That is already calculated. That is seven eighty-four meters square. For this cost, you have to find out. Okay. So cost of uh, cost of planting, cost of planting, cost of uh, planting for one meter square is rupees forty. For one meter square, rupees forty. Therefore, required cost. Required cost means uh, cost of planting for this much, okay, this much meter square that is rupees 40 into rupees 40 into 784. Okay, so 784, 4 you multiply 61, 32, 33, 3 remainder 31. So rupees 31360. Rupees three one three six zero landing for this uh, for for seven eighty four meters square is okay like this uh, easily we can find out okay so here uh, in the diagram itself you can find out this uh, uh, side of the smaller square okay understand or separately you do for understanding purpose I have written uh, separately you do in the diagram itself so this part you write clear enough understand. So same type of problem I will give it as homework. Do homework problem for better practice. Okay.